Back in April, the National Park Service decided to allow the wild horses at Theodore Roosevelt National Park to remain. But wild horse advocates are voicing concern after the park detained one particular stallion. Kelly Ringer says she and a few others rode horses in the park, and one wild horse seemed particularly interested in one of their mares and tagged along with the group for a while until spooked by a bison. Ringer says this also caused her horse to buck her off. Although she says the horse wasn't a nuisance, the park has detained the stallion ever since. He made that trip to Medora a once-in-a-lifetime trip, having him in camp with us, and so, and now he's lost his freedom because of it. Another wild horse advocate says she's concerned the park has found a workaround to allowing the horses to roam free in the park. Senator Hovind said that he is, he believed that the park would communicate with the public, would start talking to stakeholders about the future management of the horses, and that they would be more transparent and they're not, and so that's a, a concern. We reached out to Theodore Roosevelt National Park for comment, but haven't heard back.